Welcome to Kong Summit. Today, we will look at everything involved in getting API designed, deployed, and documented. We will start off in Insomnia, where we can create design document for our API. This API returns a list of products that Kong offers. It has a get endpoint and returns either 200 or 400 when it's there. Insomnia performs static code analysis, also known as a linting for our specification, as we edit it, telling us when there is an error. Once the specification is valid, right-hand side panel renders documentation and let us explore available requests and responses. The entire API specification is quite long, so we will swap it with something that I prepared earlier. It contains precisely the same information plus additional endpoints and schemas. Now we can use it to generate a declarative configuration file for Kong Gateway, which we will use to bootstrap a new node with the DAC CLI by running DAC Sync. As you can see, routes defined in our API specification and by extension our declarative config are available through the new gateway. Now imagine that our API that we're using has some performance issues, so let us add rate limiting plugin to our configuration to protect the underlying service from potential denial of service. We'll configure rate limit for three requests per minute per IP. After running DEC again, we can repeatedly call API until we get rate limiting error. Now when our API is protected, it's time to get it in front of our customers. We can upload the OpenAPI specification to the portal using Kong Manager or Declarative Portal CLI. Built-in editor in Kong Manager provides preview available at the right-hand side and we can visit portal itself and we can see the specification visible to any public consumer of our API. Now let me edit some portal homepage locally by adding new paragraph saying Welcome to Kong Summit demo documentation. When we run this portal deploy, we can go ahead and refresh home page so we can see our changes. Now, let me show you one of my favorite parts of this. When you click Summit Demo and choose one of the endpoints, we can click Try it out button to request our API. We can change any parameters uh, of this request. Say we want you to see talks from day two, so we will change this date parameter. Also, you can see here, there are little snippets of shell, JavaScript, Python, and Ruby code, so your consumers can get started with this API without any effort. In under four minutes, we designed an API, generated a Kong Gateway configuration file, adding rate limiting plugin, and documented the API in a developer portal, including interactive documentation. Our customers can get started with the Summit API and learn more about available session and Kong products. If you want to learn more, go to kongitu.com/solutions/slash create developer platform.